Happy Friday, everybody. I thought I would, so we have not, I feel like we haven't had yard sales much here uh, over, well, with everything that's going on. But yesterday I was actually running some errands and I saw a yard sale sign. And so um, it, I should always start this. If you can see and hear me, let me know. Give me a hello. Tell me where you're coming in from. If you're watching it on replay, give me a hashtag replay so I know, know you were here. Uh, just to make sure this is working. But anyway, so I was running errands yesterday and I saw a yard sale sign, so I was super excited. Uh, I think we are going to have more in our area. Are you guys having them in your area? Let me know. Uh, they're so fun. But anyway, so I decided to stop at uh, this yard. I saw this sign, so I just stopped at this yard sale. Then I'm leaving, I see another yard sale sign. And then I'm like, as I kept going, I'm like, is this a whole like community-wide sale? So I kind of think it was. Uh, there were, there were a lot in one uh, area by where we live. So I got to go to a lot of sales. I did not get a ton of things, but it was just fun. Oh, one of the things I put, I put away. Uh, I got one of the old like vintage Santas. Um, he's kind of like, he was like yay big. He's the biggest one I have found. Um, so I did get one of him, but I already put him away in the Christmas stuff. So I can't share him. I didn't, like I said, I didn't get a ton, but, oh, and I did get some records that I didn't, I put those away as well, so I won't bore you with going to grab them, but I did find some records uh, for our record player and then that Santa, but then I found a couple of bigger things, so I thought I'd just share them with you guys because it's fun to see what people are picking up. So the other day I shared that um, wreath that I made with that garland, and so with the yard sale, or sorry, the thrift store embroidery hoop, I always pick them up, I said, and wouldn't you know it. <laughs> Yesterday, I find two of these still in the package. You guys, you can't make this stuff up. They are not the same of the garland uh, that I use, but still very pretty. So I found two of them, two packages. And so always pick these up. So garlands, faux flowers, stems, if they're pretty and you like them, pick them up because they can be expensive and you can use them for so many things. So this one's kind of got, um, sorry if that's too loud, not a neighbor's dog is barking, but it's got the little white roses on it. <laughs> Just like the one I used for the, uh, for the wreath. It's, it makes me laugh when these things happen or like when I want to buy something or I'm looking for something and I don't buy it and then I go into a thrift store, I go to a yard sale and I find something very similar. Um, it just makes me laugh. So still a pretty garland and then there were two so that always makes me happy because i can make something fuller or um or whatnot but perfect for summer and spring so i mean it's even got the white just like the one i kind of shared the white little things on there as well so i thought that was funny um and then i haven't been to the thrift store or our restore recently so i gotta i gotta do that maybe i will go next week and then this, these are probably my favorite finds from yesterday, you guys. So I'm always picking up wood boxes, ba old baskets. Um, they're, they just, you can use them for organization and they just make things look clean. And look at this, look at these. The, you guys, just let me just show you the whole thing. So they're not a drawer, like there's no drawer front, you know, like pull or anything. They look like the inside of a drawer. They've got these things on the bottom. They need to be cleaned up. I found six of them and they were a dollar each. What? I was so excited. The inside looks like this, but you can use these for so organizing all kinds of things. Um, I needed to, I needed another box kind of this size for in our linen closet uh, for, you know, just for like first aid and those kinds of things. Uh, but aren't these pretty? The wood is old. You could definitely stencil or something on these. You could chalk a to them or something, but six of them and they were a dollar each. I, I couldn't believe it. I was so excited. So I grabbed all of them, but look at that. So this, this, this was definitely my favorite find. Things that are pretty and functional and will help me stay organized, I'm all about it. So another thing I found, which was kind of a cool find. Okay, I'm gonna have to. You guys, look at this lamp. So, I, 
think I'm going to share it. Oh. It kind of reminds me of World Market, but uh, isn't that pretty? It's like carved. It's wood. It doesn't, it's wood all the way up. So it doesn't, um, I'm going to, what do I want to say? Like screw together, you know, like the lamps do, but it's all carved. It's so pretty, but the bottom kind of looks, doesn't look as bright or as colorful as this. So I'm going to probably use the restore finish on the bottom and I will share, I will share that with you. Oh, my screen's going dark again, but. It says on the bottom, made in India, hand carved, uh, but isn't that a pretty lamp? No lampshade, but we know we can find those inexpensive. So I will be on the hunt for that. I'm hoping this will go in the living room. If not, it'll, it can go in the family room or even in our back porch, but isn't this pretty? The bottom, I mean, even if this was like all broken and the bottom was still intact, I would have picked it up just for that bottom piece. It's just so, so pretty. Uh, so yeah, so yeah, you could definitely, um, I just saw a thing, a comment that said, I always get lamps to repurpose. Yes, you can do so many projects with those. So you guys are in here. Yes, the dove, these are, are, are these called box joints? Dovetail tail is more like triangular. If I'm right, if I'm, I could be totally wrong, but Yes, these boxes are, this was unbelievable. I could not believe a dollar each. I was so excited about that. I will, if you have any questions, let me know. Um, and I will come back up and look at the rest of your comments. So the other thing, sorry, that's kind of loud. Okay. So the other thing I got is a huge wood box. It's not huge, but it's, it's a lot bigger than the other one. There was no lid and she had some like soccer balls and basketballs in there that she was selling and so I said is the box for sale <laughs> and it was but you guys okay again it needs to be cleaned out it looks like it's just been storage in like a garage uh, what is even happening so let me the inside, here's the inside. Okay, and then the front, the front, like uh, <clears throat> when Matt came home and he saw this, it'd be a really cool um, toy box or, you know, something for, oh my gosh, this, you guys, <laughs> makes me so happy. It makes me so, so happy. So when I saw this, I don't know if I, I mean, it's, it's not huge. So it's not like one of those big chests or what are they called? You know, where like the old metal chests. It's not a chest. Why am I thinking like the, what am I thinking of? You guys know what I'm talking about. It's not like that. It's not that size. It's smaller. So that's good for our house. But, uh, oh my gosh. Oh, you guys, you guys were falling down. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so it's a perfect size, but if not, so when I find pieces like this and if they're not functional the way they are, you guys, look at that detail. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the wood alone is worth the $5 that this costs. So you could take this apart and use the wood for an old trunk. See, that's why I love you guys. That's what I'm talking about. Um, yeah, so you could take the wood apart and use it as, as other things. So I just, but Matt came home and he said, oh, it's just cool the way it is. It is. It'd be cool for blankets and stuff once I clean it out. I love the hole in the, can you guys see that? I love the hole in the wood. It's just so, can you see that? Where are my fingers coming? Uh, so I didn't find a ton. That's all I found. Um, the Santa and the records, but... Uh, I think we're going to head out tomorrow. And I think there were some today, but I had two Zoom meetings today, so I couldn't get to them. But, but yeah, so are there yard sales where you guys are? Are they popping up? I hope they are. I'm looking through any of your questions or comments. Hello, Elizabeth. From England. My grandma was from England. Special, special lady. Um... 
yeah the lamp beautiful lamp those carvings are amazing they are amazing i just need to find a lamp shade and then hopefully i will share a video or a reel of what the restore does to that um i love that stuff i share it all the time here but it's just kind of cool to see it on different projects an old trunk yes that's what i couldn't think of that yeah, so this would be a great uh, for pillows too. Throw pillows or blankets, quilts. I do have some of those. That would be pretty in there. I just don't know where I would set it yet. So, but I don't care. I was still picking it up. <laughs> yes, there are yard sales here. Community ones as well. Community ones are my favorite because you can hit so many and you're not driving from like one place to the other. Another favorite of mine are church sales. Do you guys ever have sales in churches around your area? Oh my gosh. I mean, some of them are not great, but I, they're one of my favorite things. Um, they are, I just love church sales and then community wide. So you can get to a, a lot of them. And that's what I think it was yesterday. Cause I'd get in my car and I'd see another sign and then I'd see another sign. And then, so it was just kind of fun. I was just in one area by where we live and there were a lot of sales to go to. So Miss the box. Which box did you miss? My favorite thing. I will show you. So, so I don't find a ton of things all the time, but these, they were, there were six of them uh, for a dollar each, for a dollar each. You can't, well, obviously now with the way lumber prices are, you can't make them for a dollar each. And this old wood, it's, it makes me so happy just like on this box it just makes me so happy and this i can use for so many things just get organized put them in like the linen closet and stuff so that was uh yeah these that was my favorite find six of those because i can use them for so many things okay do you guys have any other questions if you guys are yard sailing if you are thrift shopping if you are at estate sales if you're at an antique store share a photo share what you share um share stories or videos or whatever and tag me i want to see what you guys are finding too so please 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 tag me because i i love uh watching what other people get and what you're finding okay this is a good tip acid in wood can discolor good linens you can line a box with folded sheets or a towel on the bottom that's a good tip acid in wood i've never heard of that before i mean i know like old i mean you, i know you got to really clean them and stuff but i've never heard of the acid in the wood can discolor good linens yeah yeah definitely this like definitely they need a good scrubbing and then sit out in the sun for a while but there's still some good finds so if you guys are out shopping take pictures i want to see what you're getting i just want to see what's in like your thrift stores and your at your estate sales or yard sales or uh, antique stores it's always fun to see different uh people in just around, like I said, it'd be fun to do a show like that, just to go to thrift stores and yard sales around, just travel and see what you can find in different parts of the US or the world. I think that would be so much fun. Okay, I'm going to hop off now. If you have any questions watching it on replay or comments, leave them and I will be sure to get them. Have a great weekend. It's so pretty here today. I had to throw on just a sweater. It was a little chilly, but that's like my favorite. I do not want it too hot. Anybody else not like really hot and humid weather? I'm just, I'm not, <laughs> it's just not for me. So I hate it when we go straight from spring or winter to summer, but we've kind of had a good spring this year. It's been cooler and not hot, right? We had a couple of hot days earlier this week, but it's cooler now. So that's a good thing. And I will share throughout the weekend, if we do go to some sales, I will share in stories and stuff. And then um, I will share my haul if I find anything. But uh, so have a good weekend and I will see you guys soon.